Okay, today's video is going to be uh, uh, simple at the beginning, but get a little more complex at the end because we're going to try to build on the stuff we've already learned. Um, so the second half of this video, if you haven't watched the previous videos, you may get a little lost, so you may want to watch those. Uh, but we're going to start off by learning two new commands. The first uh, command is the df command, which shows you um, the, the space used on your hard drive. So here's a list of my drives. Uh, it gives their total size in the second column here. Third column is uh, how much is being used, how much is available, uh, usage is in percentage, and then where it's mounted. Uh, as you can see, uh, it's a little hard to read because it's written in bytes. If we use the dash H command, which makes it human readable, it changes it to gigs and megabytes and uh, makes it a bit easier to read. Now this first line here, uh, drive SDG1 is my main drive. You can see that because it's mounted at my as my uh, root directory. So that's the one we're going to be interested in today. So we're going to use grep, which we've used in the past. So we're going to pipe the output into grep, and we're going to grep the line that says SDG1. And now we get just that line. Now for the second uh, new command of the day, we're going to use awk. Awk is a very powerful tool for manipulating data. Um, we're going to use it, as many uses, we're going to use a very simple uh, use of it today. And basically, we're going to pipe that output, and we're going to go uh, single quote open squiggly brackets, which I'm pretty sure is the technical name for those type of brackets. And uh, what we want is the output of the usage and percentage, which is the fifth column. It's going to go based on empty space. So we can see that this is one, two, three, four, and five. So what we're going to do is we're going to type print dollar sign five and then we're going to close the brackets close the single quotes hit enter and you can see we got 48 percent now if you want to know what the 48 percent is for we can also output the first column but it's not going to detect this space right here as you can see it gives us the output but it's hard to read because there's not a space right there before the 48 way to fix that is go here and put quotations with a space in them and now makes it a little easier to read. We're going to take it a step further. We're going to come back here and right here we're going to add, I'm sorry, right here we're going to add quotes and we're going to write drive space close quotes is with a space on either end inside those quotes and then we're going to put quotes at the end here used Whoops. and close those quotes. So we get the output drive, this drive, is 48% used. Now what we want to do is we want to take that and uh, we want to loop it so we get a regular ongoing message. So we're going to put it in a while loop as we've done in the past. Uh, so we're going to use while one uh, and what that does is set it so it loops forever until the user stops it. So we're going to do this during that loop we're also going to add a command here at the end for sleep for five uh, by default it's seconds uh, if you want to make it minutes we can put an M there so every five minutes and then we're going to close that loop with done we're also going to want to add at the beginning here of the loop the clear command to clear the screen we hit enter and it gives us an easy readable output and every five minutes it will update that. Now we're going to take it a step further and what we're going to do is we're going to use notify output which we've used in a previous video. So we're going to do notify I'm sorry notify send to get a visual output and uh, what we're going to use here is we're going to do quotations and then this thing that looks like a single quote but it's not a single quote. I don't know the technical name of it, but it's actually the key that's next to the one key on your keyboard uh, on the same button as that little symbol there. Uh, and what this is going to do is anything we put inside there is it's going to run that command and basically take that output and use it with the, with the notify send uh, command. We're going to close that and the, sing and the double quotes here at the end. Now, every five minutes, 
we're going to get this little pop-up down here in the bottom that stays up on the screen for about five seconds, letting us know how much space uh, is being used on that drive. If we wanted to, we can change it from minutes to hours, and we'll do one hour. So every hour, we'll get this little pop-up down here in the screen. Um, there, please visit uh, bashscripts.info for more scripts and commands like this. And there's also a available uh, a, this script written out in a script that you can copy and paste and manipulate if you wanted to, and if you're having problems typing it out yourself, because I know it's kind of long. So thank you for watching today, and I'll be making more videos soon.